He's an adoptive Oregonian, adapting to the Beaver State after starring at Oregon State and now being beamed all across the state and around the globe for that matter, as Lamar Hurd is in his third season as TV broadcaster alongside legendary Kevin Calabro for the Trailblazers. Once a bachelor, now a married man, the other side of Lamar is the other side of basketball. What's up, man? I saw the new side, I like it. Days off at home in the NBA are few and far between. Although this is an off day from the Blazers, um, it's not an off day from life and from helping people. Anything that's hard is it's worthwhile if you can fight through it. Lamar Hurd is out getting kids involved with the game he loves so deeply. Be ready. Ah! We're only alive for so long. Oh, that was big! All of us on this big. world, and I was taught at an early age from my mom, from my basketball coach, that we're given the things we're given. We're given the influence, the resources to go out and try to help other people that need it. Texas Transplant started the other side of basketball in 2012. I just felt called to start working with kids, largely, if not fully, in part to my youth experience as a kid in Houston, Texas. I moved out of my mom's house as a sixth grader to live with a basketball coach who ultimately became a father figure to me. I'm gonna stand by you because I'm gonna run with you. Learning how to live a life through his hoops passion. I just wanted to mimic that as much as possible. The kids at Vernon McKinney Elementary, a Title I school in Hillsboro, are extremely grateful for their after school specials with Herd's other side clinics on Mondays. We try to get in front of kids that need us most as much as possible and we found that here at Vernon McKinney. Every opportunity we can give our kids, we're going to take it, and this is not just a good opportunity, it's been a great one. A revved up pack of about 30 4th through 6th graders attended on this day with a waiting list to get in the gym for the kids that need just a little assist in life. It's that one more adult that says, I see you, you matter, and I care about you, and I care enough to spend my time with you, so that's huge for our students. Because we're now a family, you're not getting rid of us. Offering a place in space and the opportunity to make mistakes. Here we go. Yep. Sometimes the students will carry themselves differently in the gym than they will in a classroom. Like they just move differently and they, they, they feel a sense of pride because they're like, look what I can do. And they are willing to risk. And that's a huge thing that sports provide students. You miss every shot you don't take. Ready, go, go. Omar Leary is a 2005 Lincoln High School graduate, went on to play at the University of Oklahoma now serves as Lamar's director of the other side of basketball. It's not really about basketball. I mean, that's just a theme, that's a hook. Uh, it's really once you get them uh, in an environment and you create a climate that everyone's accepted and everyone can learn from, I think it just really pays great dividends for uh, energizing them to do whatever it is that their theme is. Our hope is that we just plant some seeds in them throughout this basketball clinic that it sticks with them. Let's go, on the feet. As long as kids can find that thing that they're enthusiastic about and passionate about, uh, that's a win-win. It kind of goes back to it being a village. We do our part from the basketball side. We know that the, the teaching, the leadership here at this school, they're doing their part, and we hope that the kids are experiencing the same thing at the next phase of their life. The other side will be holding tryouts for its Mako competitive club team for teens at the YMCA Beavers and Hoop on March 2nd and 3rd. In studio, Nick Krupke, Fox of Oregon.